It's done. I got him. Uh, you tell Mark down these coordinates and send your man out here. You hear me? Is he alive? Hey, hey, Drifter. Yeah, he's alive. But I won't promise you how long he's gonna stay that way. Deacon out. Boozer, you there? I was just calling to check up on you. Yeah, Dean, come here. Hang in there, buddy. As soon as we get that arm patched up, we're riding north, just like you said. Ah, I so. God, I miss you. Dude. Just work on getting better. I still got some work to do on the bike, and we gotta stock up on some gear. Once you're patched up, we're out of here. Deacon out. Mass grave. I keep forgetting it. God damn it! I gotta burn him out. I gotta make it safer to ride. Another bounty. <laughs> Weeping Angel. This has got to be it. Now, where'd you hide the stash, Leon? What do we got? Huh, maybe in one of these. Got it. Nice 
gotta figure out who I'm gonna give this to. Boozer! Booze man, are you listening? Uh no, oh, you're not gonna believe this. I just saw a goddamn chopper! A, a chopper? What, what are you talking about? A Nero chopper! It, it just buzzed right over me and acted like I wasn't even there! Wait, all this time and a fed chopper shows up out of nowhere? Yeah, I'm gonna chase them down and I'm, uh, uh, I'm gonna see what the hell they're doing! Hey, Deke. Be careful. Don't get too close till you know what the hell they're doing. And don't do anything stupid. Hell no, I'm not gonna do anything stupid! Damn! Fix this. That should do it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on, hold on. They're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping.
actually. Yeah. Uh, I don't know 
fuel to get back. Going all over hell and back today. Fuel is the least of our problems when we're on the ground. I heard something. hear that? I heard something. Yeah. I heard something. What was 
Boozer, you there? Booze man, come back. Deke, hey, I'm here. You've been going to the The hero guy, the soldier. What the hell he was? Who took Sarah? What, what are you? He had an ID badge. What was the name? Oh, God, O'Brien. Wouldn't shut up about it. All the way out to Three Finger Jack. Hey, he's alive. Boozer, he's alive. There, the whole camp was wiped out. No, I know that, but I heard I went into their LZ. They... Wait, wait, you, you went into their LZ? What the? Just listen to me. I heard you on the radio talking about a man named O'Brien. Hank, don't. Not, Bruiser. I'm not. I'm just. Hey, okay, uh, get some sleep. Hey, get out. Cemeteries are filled with freakers, not martyrs. And you had to keep moving because if anyone had found your unmarked van, they'd have blown it to hell. Just so we wouldn't have to listen to your bullshit Radio Free Oregon.
that mobile medical unit. Here's the generator. Shit! Power's off, figures. Fuse blown. Okay, let's see. What's going on here? Oh, where the hell am I gonna get a fuse? Wait, no, not this way. This is it. All right, where? <laughs> Still got this. This is Radio cool. Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Black helicopters have been spotted in the skies. You might have seen them. Heard them. Thought you were losing your mind. You're not. They're real. And they're proof that I was right. We thought Nero died out here like the rest of them, caving under their own stupidity. But no. That should be like I said, they've been lying and wait all this time till they can crawl up out of their holes green lights, green lights, and reclaim this green world. Lights, green lights, but it ain't happening. Not on my watch. And don't go running towards them, thinking they're gonna save your ass. Any man wearing a uniform worth a damn died more than two years ago. These men, they'll shoot you on sight. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Jesus. Cope, they're not trying to reclaim shit. You don't have a damn clue what you're talking about. Except, yeah, yeah, they will shoot you on sight. Lucky guy. Closer look. No, not this way. There we go. I gotta clear it out. I gotta cut down on the swarmers out here. They see me, I'm dead. I guess I'll come back later. 
burn out these nests. Sniper on the road. Oh, God damn it. God damn it, not now! Hello, squatter camp. The sons of bitches have been setting up ambushes around here, yeah? the road two years ago <laughs> you would have gone splat nests I gotta clear them out I gotta make it safer to ride through here yeah. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later Tucker, Alki. Over at the dig site. Well, which one, goddammit? The north one. Back there. If anybody touches this bike or anything on it, I break your fingers. Whatever, man. Jesus. I keep telling you, everywhere you look, it's all one giant lava field. 25 feet solid rock. It'll take jackhammers to. I don't need a lecture, goddammit. I get it. No, you don't. But these people are hungry, even if they had all their strength. It'll take them months to finish this job with picks and shovels. I don't give a shit! We're all hungry, Al. But this job's got to get done whether it takes all goddamn year. It's not like we got somewhere else to be now, do we? Wait. Not finished. We'll make it quick, will you, Al? I got things to do. Rippers. This morning, 
One of my men spotted a large group of them coming over the pass. And no one stopped them? How the f... Tucker, you know we're already spread thin. Are, are they headed north? Al, are they headed towards us? Yes or no? I... I don't know. Maybe he knows. <laughs> what the fuck are you oh. up to now, huh? What's this about, huh? Damn it, Al. It's not his job to know. It's your goddamn job to know. I can't be at two places at one time. You're the one me here, running your dig. You want me out there in the shit, chasing the rippers. Go check the store, see how much ammo we got left. I'll tell Wheeler to watch the dig. What are you looking at? I don't know, I'm just waiting for you to smarten the fuck up. Don't! Did you track down Leon? Good thing someone around here knows how to make things happen. Ride with me. How long has it been since you found someone, brought him in? The kind of people left out in the shit aren't the kind of people you want me bringing in. We lost two more to the fever. It's not my problem. You want our food? I'm making it your problem. I told you, we'll do runs for you, but we're not joining your goddamn camp. Remind me again, my old woman's memory. Why is that? <laughs> because it's a waste of time, Tuck. <laughs> well, aren't you the optimist? Where's Boozer? He said he was gonna head over to Copeland's camp, see about trading for some fish. You're not in bed with Cope now, are you? His camp near yours? It's not closer or further. Look, I'm not Boozer's old lady. He goes where he wants. No, we can't <laughs> Jesus. Bury these you keep the shit burning all day and night. Got a lot of freak corpses piling up out here. With men like you doing your jobs. Damn right we keep burning. Get used to it. Try using more gasoline. Burns faster, less fumes. Like we got so much to spare? When it's all gone, what are you gonna put in that bike of yours? Spit and sweat? Now what the hell is going on here? The count's off. Storage is missing food and some ammo. Jesus. Who was on watch last night? Wheeler. Tonight, double the watch. This shit's starting to piss me off. You got it. Trouble in paradise? It's like I was saying. Camp's like a prison. Bunch of goddamn lazy liars, thieves, rapists, and murderers. You know why that is? No idea. Because that's who we are. The freak show. Only folks survived were those mean enough, nasty enough to out-freak the freaks. The rest are here, hoping I feed them, protect them, keep them nice and cozy and warm so they can sit on their asses and watch the world end. You, get your ass back to work. Don't make me go get Cyrus. Lazy sons of bitches can screw ah. around all they like on their time. Daytime is my time. Running this camp is no different than running a prison. I can't remember what you said. You were, you were what? You were a warden or something? <laughs> Nothing so high and mighty. I was matron of the women's ward. You look like the sort who might have spent some time in the pen, back in the day. You ever do time? I had my share of trouble, but I never landed in K-State. I got a job for you. Larson was on a run yesterday. Passed through Marion Forks, said he saw someone. A young woman looked like, but he only caught a glance. He stopped to look around, but he never found her. Is he sure? Larson's been doing this long as you. He knows a person from a freak. But you got a knack for this. It won't be long. You head over there and find her before the freaks do. I'll see what I can do. But look, Tuck, I want the rest of my credits for Leon. You bring me warm bodies, I'll give you all the credits you can spend. I gotta go find Wheeler. Someone's looking at a night in the shack. Alkai. What do you want, Drifter? What's your problem? Hmm? One of my men uh, escaped a... Ripper camp. 
over by Iron Butte. Got tortured, like they always do. But this time, they kept asking me if he knew about it. Two bikers, two men, asking me if he'd ever seen them or heard of them. A lot of bikes around here. What's it, what's it got to do with me? The Ripper called them mongrels. How many drifters still flying colors around here? As if that shit matters. If you ask me, you got a price on your head. How's it feel to be on the other side? Now, why don't you just show me what you got because I don't have time for your bullshit. Whatever you say, Deke. Thanks. Need anything else? Okay, sure. I just gotta figure out who I'm gonna give this to. I'm gonna go patrol around for a bit. We can't head north until I get better gear. Tucker it is. Hey, Tuck. You get my drugs from Leon? Yeah. Yeah, Cope wanted me to sell to him, but uh, I know who my friends are. Huh, you got that right. Go see Alki. I heard Larson brought in a stash of shotguns and rifles. Maybe he's got something you can use. 